that's a difference. I believe that's our process of life or death or whatever we call it, just the process of what we do, isn't it? <clears throat> See, the most compulsive thing in most human beings is they want to draw a conclusion about everything. Because without drawing conclusion, they will not feel confident about anything in their life. They must draw a conclusion, oh, she's good, oh, she's okay, she's not okay, he's all right, that's so not good, I love this person, I hate this person, this is my friend, this is my enemy, every kind of conclusion. Conclusion means, essentially, what is the conclusion of your life? Death, isn't it? Every time you conclude, in some way you die, you must know this. You know, I can take you back. Are there religious people? Hello? Are you? Religious people? Because people are fundamentally misunderstanding their memory to be intelligence. This is the fundamental problem. Our education systems are designed like this, religious processes are designed like this, largely society is designed like this. Memory is misunderstood as intelligence. If you went to school, I didn't go much, nor did you, both of us are lucky that way. <laughs> <laughs> you're right, you're right. You're right. <laughs> but uh, when you went, when I went to school, what I saw was people memorize everything and on a specific day, which is called examination day, they'll go and puke it there. <laughs> if they puke really well, they are great. You're a great school. I huh? puke little. I never puked at all. <laughs> I never puked at all. You never puked? <laughs> never, not even one minute. <laughs> I puke little, <laughs> but those who puked everything were number one out there. So this is not just in a classroom, everywhere this is built, we are misunderstanding memory as intelligence. As I said earlier, great times are coming when your memory will mean nothing because there is a simple phone in my machine which has more memory than all of you put together. Hello? So your memory will mean nothing. But if you lose that phone, your memory huh? will be in trouble too. No, no, we can have it implanted in the skin. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, what we thought as great value, I want you to understand how this world has been built, these civilizations and cultures have been built. 